Welcome back, Seth Bling here. I've got the Minecon crew together, <laughs> Minecon 2012, and uh, we're going to be showing you guys Freeze Tag in Minecraft. So with these guys' help, I'm going to demonstrate the game. Now, Freeze Tag is a kid's game, uh, and this was actually suggested to me by a viewer named Mr. Cesar57. Hope I pronounced that right. Uh, basically, the way it works is you're running around and whatever. Uh, if I, I'm the one who's it. And we can tell that because I'm the only blue name here, and also it said that I was it. <laughs> uh, and if I hit uh, log, then uh, he'll turn blue. And then one of these other guys can go ahead and hit him, and it'll unfreeze him. So basically, I'm the person who's it, and I can freeze people by hitting them, and, and their the teammates can unfreeze. And so if I just, you know, <laughs> get him, uh, <laughs> aw, it, it'll... Hmm. Uh, Basically, my goal as the person who's hit is to get everyone frozen, and the game will keep going until that happens. Uh, so there's one thing though: if 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 you uh, if you jump around while you're frozen, you're able to move. Go ahead and try moving around, good. Yeah. So you're actually able to move pretty quickly, and there's just no way I could really make it work so that the player couldn't jump around. So the rule is: don't jump around if you're frozen. <laughs> but otherwise, um, once I get all three. The game is over, and it says everyone frozen, and then somebody as new is it. Now there's a five second grace period when uh, when the the game restarts and a new person is it. So you have five seconds of resistance with which to uh, not get tagged. And so I guess Log is going to try and if I can unfreeze Good. You just have to keep. You just have to remember who your teammate or who your teammates or sorry who the person who is it is, because it only gotta, says it once at the beginning of the game. Got to watch out for fall damage too. Yeah, yeah, that's a good point. If you take fall damage by accident, it can freeze or unfreeze you. So, uh, it's something else to watch out for. I got you guys. I don't think he sees me. Oh, God. <laughs> Run. All right, so now I'm frozen. You can see, well, my uh, field of view went really big. Uh, who, who's it? Good, go ahead and just freeze me. No, come back. <laughs> I, was, I still have my grace period. So, my field of view goes really narrow, and I'm trying to move around, and I can't. And there we go. So that's the game. Now, the cool thing about this is, uh, this isn't just a world with you know a bunch of trees that you can download. Uh, although you can download this if you'd like, uh, I have I have a link in the video description. You can download the world, but you can also just download the schematic for this box. And this box is what runs the entire game. If you look inside, there's a bunch of redstone and command blocks. And you put this anywhere in the world. Uh, well, preferably it should be either somewhere near spawn or near the game area. And uh, and, and it'll run the game for you. And there's just a ton of command blocks and hoppers and redstone, and and it, it just deals with the scoreboard and <laughs> does a bunch of magic. But you just import this schematic into your world, preferably near, near the spawn point, and you can create your own arena. So just I'd recommend kind of encasing it in some blocks so that people can't escape. And uh, it puts everyone in adventure mode so that they can't break blocks. And you can just play. So uh, yeah, I recommend you try this. Try this out for yourself. Have fun with it. Thanks again to Mr. Cesar, Cesar. I don't know, Mr. Cesar fifty seven for the suggestion. Uh, if you would like to suggest ideas for videos, I actually have a pretty new uh, subreddit. Uh, there's a link in the video description for that, and you can suggest ideas there for videos you think I should do. So good way to get suggestions. Obviously, I, I do listen to suggestions from time to time. So. Uh, so that's a good way to get your ideas to me. Let me head back into survival mode and actually when I go to survival mode it puts me in adventure mode. You can go ahead and finish it up. Congratulations, you win. <laughs> uh, thanks, thanks guys for helping me demonstrate the Minecon crew <laughs> and, uh, and download it, try it out. Thanks for watching.